My people, the talk say story no they finish. So this one is why I keep giving up things day after day that will know build stories that will bring up issues that will bring concerns you know serious and big concerns because according to what we are hearing right now um the boy that some time back although we um Adiron kept brought um and started imposing on the only that it is only son we are beginning to hear some rumor that that boy has a potentiality of being uh, Oluri um, um, Adirunke's son from another man. And why was she bringing the son to come impose it on the Oni? It, it has to be someone related to the Oni that when they try to trace the bloodline, it will match the Oni in one way or the other. And who is this person? Nobody wants to call the person out. But we know that the bloodline matches the, that of the only. That was why they had that confidence to, you know, pin the boy on the only. And the question that the only asked that, you know, it got everyone talking was that, when do I have a 25-year-old son? Because <laughs> only just turned 50. Yeah, of course, he turned 50. And and we know very well that if only has a 25-year-old son, then he had the son when he was 25 for the son to turn up to be 25 as well when he is 50. so all of these things put together don't keep making sense day after day these things don't keep making sense because whatsoever it is that these women hope to achieve we know very well that they have the potentiality of doing whatsoever it is they want to do because even after they have mount threats, they have said that ah, I would deal with you people, I would do this, I would do that. Nothing happens. You know, they are they are now used to the empty threats and no actions. These women are now used to that fact that eh, all of this threat pulls out, but nothing happens. Eh? What happens? Nothing. They are already used to it. So they know very well that, well, but whatever it is, they say, oh, may I just hear tomorrow when I wake up, I go do it in a one do. And right now, the question everybody is asking is that who is the father of the child? Because if the child can be traced the bloodline to Oni, then this child should definitely belong to someone whom the Oni knows, someone who the Oni trusts. You know, someone who the Oni would not even expect that this child will come from. Yes, that is just the truth. That is just the reality. That is that. That is just the. The fact there, it it definitely comes from someone whom um, the only knows very well, and you know some persons are beginning to say that ah, it should not be only's brother or because if a bloodline can be traced to the only like that, then it has to be someone on the family. But <laughs> if this happens to be someone on the family, nobody had knows the weight and the potentiality of the destruction this will cause. It will cost a lot. It will cost so much. It will cost so much in, in such a way that someone might have to leave. Because someone in Oni's bloodline cannot be having children with Oni's wife. That is the truth. And according to what we heard allegedly, the boy is not 25. The boy is less than 25. They don't know where they projected the whole age from. He's less. So if he is less, then every single thing they are beginning to, you know, bring up is adding up that someone who is related to the only is the father of that child. And if the person is the father of the child, that was why they were confident that, oh, confident that, go run tests, go do this, go do this, because if they happen to do it, the DNA will come out in such a way that it will point that this person is related to the only. Yes, it will, because... The person who is the father of the child is related to the only. That was why they were. But the only knew very well that ah, I don't have a child now. So if they want to pin something on me, they should just pin something else. Let me know that. Oh, even if it is a death sentence, and um, this is it. You know, <laughs> and all of these things put together. And right now, we are hearing something fresh, something new, something completely out of the context. 
something we did not even expect, something nobody expected. That is what we are hearing. And we know very well what these women are capable of. We know, you know, if this is Olui Naomi, when they rose the news of Pastor Jerry Eze, Olui Naomi, we were confident enough to say that, ah, we cannot draw conclusions of this matter because it is impossible for Olui Naomi to, 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 to be that involved with Pastor Jerry Eze. Yes, we know that Pastor Jerry Eze is, is, has an oversight on her life. We know that Pastor Jerry is overseas this woman's life. But come on, come on. Olui Naomi is too matured, educated, uh, disciplined, principled to be involved like that. But when it comes to these other women, are we going to say the same thing? When it comes to the rest of Oni's wives, are we going to say the same thing? Because some, one thing we have said for another person cannot be the same thing for the other person. Yes, something we have said for another person, it can never, ever, ever be the same for the other person. Because the truth remains that this woman can do anything, any single thing at all, that will keep them an urge to remain in the palace. Anything at all that will give them that relevance and assurance that, oh, see, when you wake up tomorrow, you are waking up in the palace, so don't panic. They can do it. Any single thing that gives them that the room that says that um, you're waking up tomorrow is in the palace and lo and behold you are going to be waking up as own his wife you know that's just what they want so at the end of the day we would wait and see because this one that they want to people want to call on his brother like this we know very well that that man is a no-nonsense man he will definitely in one way or the other come out to say what is on his mind but before then let's wait and see how this pulls out because we know very well that these women are capable of anything that one we know yes we know and we know as well that Oluria de Ronke have meshed up in a million ways and if this is going to be a, a retribution for her then let it be if this is going to be one of the things that you know will bring her out of that that place that she has buried herself in then let it be but as it is right now these women have beaten more than they can chew